I've been in the battery industry for over 24 years and mostly in lead acid and five years ago when I started with Relyon selling lithium batteries most people didn't understand how lithium batteries worked and the conversation every day was are they safe and I had to talk about safety. Uh, fast forward now some markets have like adopted them and are continuing to adopt lithium rapidly and others are at the early stages, but everybody wants to talk about lithium and knows something about them. Yeah, Reliant, when we first started, we were really on the front end of the lithium iron phosphate curve. Um, people weren't really thinking about uh, a change of chemistry. It wasn't, um, really didn't have traction at that point in time. So it was a lot of chasing for business. The, the uh, cost differential was quite high. Um, and really the technology hadn't been widely used in, in the market specifically that lead acid batteries were being used. In, in Asia, the, the chemistry was being used for uh, electric buses and some things like that, but not in your everyday use like you see today. So there's been a huge shift in the acceptance level of lithium, the chemistry in the batteries, and the cost associated with purchasing a battery that's going to last a lot longer um, and have all the features and benefits that it has. So I think the biggest change is just how big the market acceptance is today. The market's been a little bit slow to adopt it, even though it's been commercially available for close to 20 years. Um, there's obviously some apprehension around the, the price level of lithium battery, but that's come down. As that came down, then the markets really started to adopt the batteries. It was kind of a phantom fear then more and more people really started to explore the technology and, and recognize all the benefits. And sometimes it's only one benefit they needed to key in on, uh, and you could get distracted by other benefits that didn't have anything, that didn't add up to anything for your application, so. It, it's fantastic uh, what's happened with lithium batteries. In fact, when we started with lithium batteries, I had a project that was very challenging, and I went through all the possible chemistries that I was aware of at that time, and uh, almost 10 years ago. And the only thing that could do what we were trying to do with this company was gonna be lithium. And that's kind of what started us down this road. And now, seven, eight years later, I look at all the different opportunities with lithium where I can do things that I could not do with traditional batteries. And that makes it exciting, it really does.